Hey everybody, welcome back to my playthrough of Ev Eternity. Uh, we are on map number four, Regicide. So, funny thing happened. I actually already played this map. <laughs> I did a full recording and everything, but it looks like I was not playing on the proper difficulty. The kills were at 111 the first time I played this. So, I don't know what difficulty that is, but definitely not ultra violence. So, I don't know how the hell that happened, but... Uh, we are on the proper difficulty now. This is a, I guess, a mostly, not mostly, just a somewhat blind playthrough of this uh, level. I already know how to beat it, but I guess it's blind in the way that, you know, there are like 30 more enemies in the stage, so I guess we'll see how that goes. So there should be a couple of specters here to start off. As you can see, there's an armor over there that we definitely need. It's gonna be very helpful indeed. Oh, it looks like there are three specters this time. <laughs> Looks like we are actually on the right difficulty now. Good. Good, good, good. I don't know how the hell that happened, but I think I need to start loading maps through the console from now on just to avoid this from ever happening. Oh man, that was... Ugh. Kind of sucks. I already played this map. I already kind of know what to do, but, you know. At least we'll have more demons to shoot, right? That's always fun. I also had some issues with my... Um, with this Droplets mod, too. Um, it's not very well optimized, unfortunately. And I think a lot of the problem comes from uh, the, uh, the little blood spatters that appear on the ground. So I went ahead and turned that down quite a bit. Uh, I tested to see if these uh, these jibs, or these gibs, like, because they never disappear from the world, so I wonder if those are causing the lag. So, and I went ahead and Turn the oh, Jesus Christ! I went ahead and turned those off, but it didn't really affect anything. The blood effect affected a lot more, honestly. So, if it starts chugging again, I'll just reduce the blood to cow limit some more. But uh, it's really not a big deal. I just love the jibs. I, <laughs> I don't want to get rid of them. All right. We got some more activity here. There's gonna be a Heck Knight, some Imps, and I think there's a, yep, Chain Gunner as well. So we get ourselves an early Chain Gun, even though the the Chain Gun is really not too far away, even if you decide not to go this uh, this path yet. So yeah, we got some commotion here. I think I was not very happy with that Heck Knight trying to snipe me. These demons gotta learn to get along, man. Oh. I'm noticing some chugging. Very funny that it's happening as I'm recording rather than off screen. Quite annoying. Um, it's not it's not terrible though, but I, it's definitely noticeable. All right, so we already got the shotgun ammo down there. There's a berserk kit inside the castle. We will get that eventually. I want to get rid of this heck knight because he can easily snipe me. Easily snipe me and cause problems. Go up here, and this is where the chain gun is originally. And let's go down here and get a secret. Past this cranny here, there is a diamond of uh, helmets. So, pretty cool, pretty cool stuff. Now let's go back up, and we still have to activate one more switch to open the main gate of this castle. Go ahead and kill these imps before they cause me some trouble. Push the switch, and we got some dudes here. Hey! Take him out. Let me see if I can uh, get the Heck Knight to kill some more imps for me. Looks like we have a... Oh god, a Mancubus. I love this guy. We have a lot of pinkies here, so they could probably serve as meat shields. There we go. Retaliate, please. I don't have all day. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. We got some imps trying to snipe me as well. So. Oh, this is not a good place to be. Let's go back over here. Hello, sir. Retaliate, please. I really would like the pinkies to uh, get some good damage off on that mancubus, but it's like that's not happening. Let's just 
finish him off ourselves then. Do that pinky and oh god. Dude, these performance issues. They're a big no-no. I feel like it's only happening with a recording. Unfortunately. Alright, everybody is dead. Let's go ahead and get the spoils. Which is not much, because we're almost full up. And now let's go into the castle grounds. We got ourselves a double barrel shotgun, some imps, and a there's a shotgunner back there. Oh god, how do you hit me? Unfortunate. Kill the shotgunner, grab the shotgun out of midair like a action hero. Oh, the revenant here is new. This is certainly new. Very scary indeed. I find it really cool how um, higher difficulties spawn new enemies. Usually games just like crank up the enemy health and damage, but this actually makes things harder in a more organic fashion. Still alive, huh? Not for long. Alright, so there is that armor over there, but we're not going to get it yet. However, we will drop that for now. In fact, I'm wondering if I should get the other secret, too. We'll go ahead and do that here shortly. For now, let's go over here and take out some pinkies. And there's going to be a couple of revenants in here. The other one doesn't seem to notice. There's something wrong with his ear bones, unfortunately. Poor guy. Punch him. Oh god, that was close. Ooh! Oh, fuck you, dude. Now we definitely have to go get that secret. Alright, push these two switches here, get some health. And now this, uh... This second secret, in order to get it, we're gonna have to put in some effort. It's gonna be a very scary situation. So, we're gonna have to... You guys hear that opening? That's this thing right here, the secret wall, and let's drop down to get to the secret area. Okay, now, once I push the button here, there's gonna be like a chain gunner, some heck knights, a um, caco demon, and as you can see, there's like no room to move around, so it's pretty scary. Uh, well, let's do it. I'm trying to get this chain gunner to fucking do something. Oh god. Oh god damn it! Okay, let's try it again. Um, I went ahead and changed my settings a little bit. Hopefully it'll be a little little less laggy now. Alright. Attempt number two, let's go. Turned down the blood quite a bit, so it's a little more mild now, but the gibbs are still there. Don't worry. I know that's the most important part. <laughs> that was really unfortunate. I, I knew that secret was going to go wrong. Those heck knights are so fucking annoying. Ugh. What are you supposed to do in that close of a range, man? It's crazy. Let's get our stuff. Go to work. Ugh. That was so unfortunate. We made it a good distance, too. Wow, I really feel like the Lost Souls don't have as much health as they used to. Maybe that's another change for this Megawad. I'm gonna take out this Erectron, because it's annoying. Oh my god. Did I really get hit by this guy twice? Press the switch here, get the stuff, get the peeps. Now it's a party. Got a lot of uh, commotion here now. Let's go over here and see. Oh god! Playing very risky right now. There we go. I want to get a bit of infighting going on, even though you do get a lot of ammo in this uh, level anyway, so. We definitely want to make sure we're at. Um, we're a little healthier before we take on that secret again. You definitely need a lot of health to tank the Heck Knight projectiles, because it's probably gonna, you know, probably gonna get hit. Okay. Uh, noticing the game is—it's not chugging as much, but 
you know, it's still happening. It's very subtle, but I can feel it. I can feel it! I really feel like just... Oh, I can't even go in the castle yet, that's right. I said I was gonna go and get the... the Berserk kit, but I can't even do that yet. So what am I talking about? Go and get the shells here, and let's get ready for our next onslaught. Our next ambush. Try to get the chain gunner to fire away, if you will, please. There we go. <laughs> Taking off little bits and pieces. There we go. The chain gunner does not even realize what he's doing. He's just way too focused on me. Knight should be sufficiently weakened. Take out this guy. Alright, looking good. Let's go back to the main entrance. Oh yeah, we got these guys. I forgot. Oh! There we go. Some more infighting would be nice. Don't get cornered. There we go, he took out the Mancubus. Good job. Good job, sir. Nice. Oh, the infighting is crazy in this, uh, this run. All right, now that we got the Berserk kit, let's get to, get to work. Some facial reconfigurations. Damn. Look at all the minerals, dude. That guy got lucky. I mean, he's still dead, but whatever, dude. Alright, so we don't have to go over here yet. Let's go over here. Um, I know I went there first last time, but there really is no point. I don't know why I'm being so stingy with ammo right now. It's not like this, uh, this map is really tight about ammo. Here. I think there is a Mancubus here too, right? Yeah, there it is. Hey there, big boy. Oh no, no, no! The fucking arch file, dude. I forgot about this guy. Oh god, that's not good at all. I don't even need to practice. I already, I already beat this map, guys. I'm just playing really terribly. How did Archfile see me, though? What the fuck? Damn, dude, that sucks. Here. Okay, let's go up and okay. Shotgun shells. Kill these imps. Yeah, the lost souls definitely have less HP. Must be another Eternity exclusive. This run had so many good um, results from infighting. It's really a shame that that just happened. So what do I do about that then? Should I just um, aggravate the archfile first or what? Actually, no. I think what I should do is go up there first and kill the Mancubus. Because I think pushing those two switches where the two revenants are, I think that um, I think that lowers the door where the archfile is. 
I'm wasting a lot of ammo here. There we go, finish him off. Uh, let's see. I guess I'll go ahead and uh, get this stuff. You guys might have noticed, but I'm very impatient right now. This is probably going to be my downfall. Come on, then. Man, this guy doesn't give a shit. <laughs> he's getting he's getting his fat ass bitten by that pinky, but he does not care at all. Still alive, eh? There we go. Thank you, sir. Oh, this is great. I love... I seem to be really lucky with all the infighting in this, uh, this map in particular. A lot of good opportunities to do so. There you go. <laughs> it's like, get out of the way, bitch! You're blocking my view! Still alive. Finish him off. Alright, so this time, yep, we're gonna go... Oh yeah, the secret. Almost forgot. Doo 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 got the secret. And now we go through, the gates are open, grab this. Alright, so here is the, the plan. Here is what I should actually be doing. Get the Berserk Kit, go up here and take these guys out first. Yeah, the arch files should not be available right now. Hmm. The fact that I'm killing all these imps up there is probably not a good thing. It's gonna revive all of them, for sure. But... Probably should have killed them outside um, in the second switch. Alright. Fat boy down. Push this. Alright, so... Uh, yeah, the secret. We're gonna go ahead and do that again here shortly, but... Let me just do my thing. Alright, alright. Take this guy out next. Kaboom, kaboom. And... Yes, arch file. Hide away. Fuck. No problem. Did you think I was worried even for a second? Mm. That Arachnotron was definitely not there before. Okay, we'll go there later. Let's go ahead and do the secret. Uh, maybe not though. I've got, I've got a pretty good amount of health right now. I don't need that or the armor down there. Uh, I probably should do it though, because, you know. You know! I have to be at full, almost full health to do this. The risk is too great. Now let's start over. Fucking asshole, Caco Demon! Where'd you come from, even? Ugh. Caco Demon's open doors now. Alright. Yeah, this is really tricky, but let's see what we can do. Gotta kill them fast. There we go. Ouch. It doesn't matter. Got ourselves a Mega Sphere to compensate. Looking good. Alright, back to the start. I love the intertwining um, map design here. It's very cool. Kill the Caco Demon. Uh, let's see. Alright, so I guess we'll go ahead and get that yellow key next. I think I'll save that Arachnotron for later. 
He has proven to be very useful for a certain encounter. Well, not not terribly useful, but he's full enough. Oh god. There we go. Hey, come on now. What the hell? Stupid ass Rectron. Idiot. He doesn't give a shit, man. <laughs> Get that mountain dew out of my face. There we go. Damn, still got a lot of health, huh? That guy out. Definitely a lot more enemies this time. Only about 30 more. It's not a not a huge deal. All right, so going close to that throne will release a trap, and you will be trapped inside here. Shotgun arrow. All Make sure you don't get trapped back there. There we go. So the throne has been blocked off, however, um, we will open that later in another area. So next we shall go into the Grand Archives. Wow, very cool library. Always found libraries to be pretty cozy. Great place to kill demons, I'd say. Oh dear. I'm not sure if that guy was there before. Got a chain gunner. Right, try not to get sniped. So there's another ambush that happens here a little later on. I wonder... I wonder if there's going to be more enemies there too. I wouldn't doubt it. Oh, that Mancubus was not there before either. This is so much more inconvenient than uh, whatever difficulty I was playing on before. By accident. Okay, the Mancubus. Still not very interested in me. Kill this Revenant. Kaboosh. Rakatron. Ah! Very good, very good. Got another Kako. Oh shit. Oh shit. I'm feeling really brave now that I have this Mega Spear. Ooh, very nice. Three hits? Damn, son. Take him out. Don't let him get away with that. Wow, he's taking that shit like a champ. Hopefully, you got some good hits in too. There we go. The Mancubus is down. Now, once we press the switch, there we go. Now the throne is back open. Right, we got ourselves a rocket launcher in here. Let me go ahead and punch these guys. Try to save some ammo, even though I don't really need to. I think I'm doing pretty well in the ammo department. All right, get the rocket launcher. Get some rockets. All right, so that's that. I kind of forget what I did to... Oh yeah, get the yellow key. Um, all right, good stuff. Eventually this lowers and uh, there's uh, some stairs that show up, but I kind of forget how I did that. Anyway, let's go get the blue key. I think the Erectatron is still skulking around. Yep, there he is. I was gonna go punch him, but it did not work out. Here we go, get some uh, infighting. Ooh, wow! How do you, how do you tank all those hits? That's crazy, man. Rakatron bullets are not to be fucked around with, man. There we 
go. Finish him off optimally. Kill the lost soul. Oh. Oh, there are three of them this time, of course. There we go. And they're down for the count. I wanna kill this arch or not arch ball, this uh Rakatron. Pump a couple of rockets into him and finish him off with the chain gun. Looking good. We got two keys now. All we have left is the red key. Is there anything down here, maybe? I know there's a switch. I don't remember doing this before. I don't know why. Oh boy. This is going to turn out to be a long episode, despite me already completing it. It's pretty... pretty lame. So we already did that second secret. Okay, we got both of them, so there are only ten enemies left. Alright, so... oh yeah, we gotta push the switch here. That lowers this uh, wall. And now we can access the teleporter. Let's go ahead and get this rocket here. Go through. Okay, so I guess there are gonna be ten enemies spawning here, or maybe nine, because there is one enemy at the exit. Alright, get the red key. And this shouldn't be too bad. Gotta get some more hits off. Need some infighting. There we go. <laughs> oh, nice! Oh, we got both of them pissed off. Oh, that's great. Go, get some more infighting. Oh, did he piss both of them off again? Man, these revenants, dude. Come on, come on, come on. How do you. There we go. Finish him off with the chain gun. Very good, very good. That was very satisfying. Okay. So we got two enemies left. That is unexpected, I have to say. Maybe there are two arch files at the end now. Oops, didn't mean to spoil it there, my bad. <laughs> yes, we got ourselves an arch file ending. A very happy ending indeed. Press these switches. Oh my god, there really are two arch files. Sometimes I hate being right. Alright, and they're both dead. We used the remainder of our rockets. Actually, we have one more. There we go. <laughs> I'm satisfied now. Whew! Alright. That's Red Aside, map number four. So, I did notice some issues with the Droplets mod. It is causing some performance problems. Uh, they're not a huge deal though, but I can see it being really bad in a larger map. But, um, we'll fix that when we get there. I'm sure this, this Megawatt has um, a handful of huge maps. So, uh, we'll see what happens, but in the meantime, that was a that was a pretty cool map. Very nice textures as always. I love the lush greenery outside, uh, the castle. Everything just looks really good as far as colors go. I noticed a bit of a blue tint on everything too. I think I mentioned this before, but everything that's supposed to be green is kind of teal looking. I don't think that's because of some color correction either. That's probably just some uh, custom skins or whatever. But Okay, yeah, that's map number four, right aside. Pretty, pretty enjoyable map, even though I died a couple times very unnecessarily. Kind of embarrassing since I already beat the map, but... Um, but yeah, very solid map. I'll see you guys in map number five. Thanks for watching.